My name is Alex Gandell, and I'm a Century 21 Troop Real Estate in Simi Valley, and I just wanted to thank you for taking a moment to um, learn about me and how we do our real estate here in, uh, in my office. I got into the real estate business um, just before I turned 21 in April of 1980, so I've been at this now for about 38 years. And uh, over the years, we've been through the ups and the downs of the markets, obviously. We've been through the good times, the bad times, the financial crunches, the high interest rates, the super low interest rates, the thin inventory markets, the saturated markets, and so on and so forth. And um, and all the way through, it's been, it's been a fun journey for me. You know, uh, originally when I got into this, I didn't have a lot of, of um, worldly knowledge, if you will. And with each turn, there's been something to learn, and it's, it happens like that every day. There's always something new to learn. In the growth of my career in business, um, I've learned from the people that I've been helping, and I've probably helped literally thousands of clients over the years. And I learned a long time ago that um, it's all about finding specialists who are really good at what they do. Over the years, as my business has grown, I've been fortunate enough to attract some very, very talented people within their chosen fields, and um, they've joined me over periods of time. Um, handling all of my marketing for my clients as well as myself as Cheryl Clayton, a licensed realtor who does basically nothing but marketing uh, for me and my clients. Then I have Jennifer Arongo who is our transaction coordinator. She's also a licensed uh, realtor and insured as well. She's my transaction coordinator um, helping me with the escrow process whether I represent a buyer or a seller or both. Then I have Stella Lopez, who's a clerical assistant, mm -hmm. who answers the phones during the week and backs up everybody here. My son Brad uh, joined the company Century 21 Troop Real Estate five years ago, and um, he does work with us here in the office as well. Um, and to top it all off, my wife Janet uh, comes in and helps all the time, so I really do have uh, a real estate family here, and I enjoy spending the time that we do together and accomplishing the goals of assisting all of you with all of your needs as well. The real estate business can sometimes be very overwhelming and part of what we've worked so hard to do here is provide accurate sources of information to help alleviate part of that stress. It's one of those things where if you have knowledge, um, you won't have to wonder. Um, accessibility for us is very easy. We literally answer the office phone seven days a week till 7.30 at night. Whether you're a buyer or a seller, Think about the volume of transactions and the different types of transactions that have been handled um, over the years. You know, when I first started, it was first time home buyers mostly, but certainly that's gravitated and become a, a, a good source of our, of our clientele. But you know, there are move up buyers, there are move down buyers, there are divorces, there are relocation transactions, there are short sales, there are distress sale, foreclosure sales, there are um, so many different types of sales and whether it's a buyer or a seller and I've handled them all and many of them and you know it's one of those things where you learn from each transaction and each person that you deal with so you can apply those new techniques to the next one. Part of the short sale process is making sure that we have a qualified attorney to handle it on behalf of the seller because there are a lot of legal things that need to be dealt with I have someone like that that I do a lot of business with when the time comes for the short sales. He does a great job, the success rate is very high, and the client is very well advised on their legal uh, and tax positions in, in doing the short sale, which is huge. Um, on the trust sales, which typically means that I'm handling the sale of a property for um, a family who has lost someone else in their family, um, there are certain things about that that are incredibly important for uh, the seller to understand and certainly for the buyer to understand because the seller is exempt from certain disclosures. I've handled countless numbers of those as well. First time home buyers, there are programs available. We have numerous lenders that we use. Some lenders don't have all the programs and we try to make sure that the buyer understands all of those different angles so that they can understand what's best for them. And Part of what we do here and a lot of it these days is the move up and the move down buyer. They can be very intricate, very tricky. You're involving multiple transactions, multiple realtors, multiple buyers, multiple sellers, and they require a certain technique in communicating the process to help alleviate the stress that's involved with them. We do a lot of that here. We have families that 
are growing and they just want a larger home. We have people that just want a larger home because they want a larger home. We have people that want a smaller home because they've had their larger home and it's that chapter in their lives. We've done it hundreds, if not thousands of times, and we can do it for you too. The real estate business can sometimes be very overwhelming, and part of what we've worked so hard to do here is provide accurate sources of information to help alleviate part of that stress. It's one of those things where if you have knowledge, um, you won't have to wonder. Um, accessibility for us is very easy. We literally answer the office phone seven days a week till 7.30 at night, including Sundays. So here we are. We're here for you. We appreciate that opportunity. And we welcome you to become a part of our real estate family. Have a great day and thank you for your time. Bye for now.